In this video we will see how to configure our form to work even if you are offline. Offline forms are generally needed in cases where you have a field force working in remote areas which do not have internet connectivity and you want to capture information inputted by them. Let's take a simple example where we want a field agent to submit an inspection report. We already have this form ready where the agent will select the product name, upload its product image and adds his signature. Here, I have a product name control which is a drop-down control. If you look at this formula, lookup function is used to fetch a list of product names from the product listing sheet. In order to cache this information, we will enable this caching property. What this property will do is, it will cache the data of this control when the user is online and opens this form. So, next time even if the user is offline it will be able to populate this dropdown from cache. You will have to enable caching property for all the controls which fetches the data remotely to be available offline. Next, for the submit button we already have a workflow configured that will submit above details to the inspection sheet. We have this inspect sheet which has all the corresponding columns. We need to enable offline submission property. What this property will do is, when this button is clicked and the device is offline, it will cache the request along with files to upload, if any and will submit the request when the user comes online. One important point to note here is that offline submission will work only on your Android and iOS devices. Let's run this app. We will have to enable the submit data option to run workflow. Select product name, this will be populated from cache if device is offline, upload a product image and add a signature. Let's submit it. Once the device is online you will see the result in the inspection sheet. Thank you for watching. For more videos visit our YouTube page.